In this video, I'm going to share with you my favorite Trips Tight End Blitz. This is a great blitz out of the nickel triple defense that is going to absolutely obliterate anyone that wants to run Trips Tight End consistently. Now, if you're new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button, or if you're watching on TikTok, hit the follow button below. It's completely free to subscribe to the channel, and it just allows you to stay up to date with the latest tips and strategies that we release every single day here on YouTube. Now, uh, the play comes to us out of the cover six. I'm in the Chicago Bears defensive playbook that has also two other amazing defenses, actually four really good nickel sets. It's got the 3-3-5 wide. It's got the 2-4-5 odd, which I think is one of the best defenses in the entire game. And then it's also got, of course, the nickel triple. And the nickel triple, in my personal opinion, is probably the most balanced defense in all of Madden 22. You guys told me that you wanted to see a nickel nickel triple defensive ebook, so I released one for you this weekend. If you want to get my full nickel triple defensive guide, there's a link in the description. You can get that defense for just 15 bucks. And I want to show you a very simple little setup for a pressure that I absolutely love out of the cover six. It's only out of the cover six and the Tampa two. Uh, as far as this works and so you want to make sure that you're in one of those two formation or one of those two plays when you're defending trips tight in and as you can see here it basically creates a man aligned look and so all we have to do to get pressure is we're just going to press coverage and we're going to blitz this corner that was in a three rec hook so as you see here it's going to create this nice blitz angle that is one of the most important things that we can get in madden 22. And then last but not least, what I like to do out of this is you can also show blitz, which is really cool. So you could show blitz and you can bring this safety down into the box, as you can see right here. And you can actually send pressure from him if you want to. Now, I like to go ahead and just man up the running back with Isaiah Simmons. I like to man up the tight end with this guy right here. And then last but not least, I actually typically will use her uh, Thompson on this play, and you can kind of do whatever you want with him. And what you'll see here is at the snap of the ball, we're going to get pretty much instant pressure off that left side edge. Now let me show you that one more time. Part of that was a little bit of a user mistake. You do have to move your user just a little bit, um, but let me show you. So again, we're just going to show blitz. We're going to blitz that slot corner, and then that's pretty much it. That's all we really need to do. I like to stand kind of right here, and what you're going to see is that, oh, I'm sorry, I blitzed the wrong slot corner. It still came in, but I blitzed the wrong slot corner. So uh, what you're going to see is against this set, we're going to have a pretty good chance at getting completely clean pressure against trip side in. As you see right there, super simple blitz, only sending five, and you're getting easy pressure. Now the beauty of this is let's say that your opponent uh, wants to go ahead and they want to uh, maybe they want to block their running back. So what we're going to be able to do, this is why I like to man up that guy on to the running back. And again, I'm going to stand kind of right in this area. And I like to man that backside safety up onto the tight end. So as you see here, it's real simple. We've got that cover four uh, to the left side. One last adjustment I like to make is I do like to put an inside third on that left side or outside third on the outside corner just to help against corner routes and all that stuff. And at the snap of the ball, what you're going to see is even though they're blocking the running back, you're going to have a pretty good opportunity to get this pressure completely clean. Okay, so now what they're going to start doing is they're going to go to a max protect type of setup. So they're going to max protect their uh, their guys on the outside here. And what you're going to see is the same exact deal. We're going to kind of hover right in here with our user. You might want to stand here. You might want to stand here. It's honestly up to you. Um, but what you're going to see is max protect, snap the ball. And as you see, we're completely screaming at the max protect from trip side end. So this is one of my favorite, 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 favorite blitzes. Now, you might say, well, Cody, that's all, all well and good, but what happens whenever they motion someone from the trips tight end uh, side to the left side? So it's going to look like this. They're going to create gun doubles, and they're going to move your blitzer out of the way, as you can see. So how are we going to get pressure if they were to do something like that? Well, my favorite way to do that... Um, and this is where I really like to man a line because when they motion, you're going to see here that my linebacker will stay in the gap if I man a line. But if I don't man a line, he won't. And that's why man aligning is really, in my opinion, the best way to be defending from nickel triple if you're going to be defending trips tight end. So we've got this guy man aligned at the linebacker position. And so what we're going to be able to do off of this is one of my favorite, favorite blitzes out of this formation. All we're going to do is we're going to globally blitz our linebackers and that in the event that they do that motion we're going to globally blitz our linebackers and then what i like to do because what you're going to see is when they motion this guy take a look at what happens now you're just going to create your quarters 
as you can see here. So we're going to do something to this extent. Whoops. Might click onto this safety and kind of bring him down. Obviously, we're going to be show where Olaf showed blitz. So he's going to be kind of right in here. But what you're going to see is at the snap of the ball, we're going to be able to send a gap pressure right at the quarterback, just like that. Now, what's even better about this pressure is the fact that we can do it with a relatively simple setup. So again, you know, again, the first initial base rush, we're just sending this guy right off the edge, just like this right here. And you're going to get that instant edge pressure. I think I actually sent that other slot corner by mistake. Now, the other thing that I did want to hit on about trips tight end, which we talk a little bit more about this in the ebook, but whenever they motion one of these outside trips receivers, let's say you've showed blitz and you've set your play up, whenever they motion this guy, then you're going to notice that it's going to bring that slot corner right into the perfect position to be able to blitz against this formation. So as you see, we send the pressure and we get that instant heat. So thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to get my full nickel triple defensive ebook, it's on sale right now. You can get the entire defense for just $15. There's a link in the description. Just hit that link. It'll take you right to the website where you can get the defensive guide for just 15 bucks.